Hey y'all, Brad from NOCO, excited to go over our next video on our Brad's gear installment. Uh, today we're gonna talk about balaclavas, very important piece of gear that you wear underneath your helmet, not to be confused with baklava, the delicious Middle Eastern dessert, uh, which is like covered in honey, uh, balaclava, baklava, get the two right, these are balaclavas. Let's talk about balaclavas. What they do, they give us a comfortable layer between our head and our helmet and not only for comfort but also protection from the elements around us so it's going to protect our neck uh, chin lips nose frostbite on the nose this is going to help save you from that uh, as well as keep you warm uh, when things get kind of gnarly out there with the weather this is my favorite balaclava pretty much run it primarily it's the sublimated balaclava from skidoo nice lightweight super breathable super comfortable take some of the sting out of the wind uh, good eye port uh, face port you can pull it down underneath your chin underneath your nose kind of maintain it wherever you want and good coverage front and back and on the sides of the neck with this guy so love this guy super lightweight nice one the second one that I use a lot is called the technical uh, balaclava from skidoo this is all windproofing here with like a micro fleece here. So this is for colder, you know, days or the trail run out to the good stuff. Also allows you to sweat a little bit if you see some good uh, climbs that you want to do or some good trees that you want to cross over through uh, because it does allow you to sweat out the top of your head. So you won't overheat in this, although this is a lot warmer. Another couple of balaclavas that I've been trying this season are those from 509. They make three different weights and I've been running the lightweight and the midweight. This is the lightweight, uh, super similar to Skidoo's, cut a little differently. I actually like the way this drapes over the, the front of the chest and the back. I've never felt any cold spots wearing this one. The face is a little small though. So what I did is I kind of pulled this a little bit, popped those seams allows it to go uh, underneath the chin without pulling down into your eyes. So this is your lightweight, very similar to the Skidoo Sublimated. And then we have the midweight. What's really cool about the midweight is all of the windproofing that they designed in here. It has a little bit of stretch around the neck, so it actually kind of holds around your neck, stops the wind from circulating through. Uh, windproof all the way around the face. You can see this material here is all windproof. What I don't like about this one though, guys, is it is kind of a small face area. So if you're gonna run this, probably just for the trail, if you're gonna get into the trees and stuff, it's gonna start sliding around. It pulls down into your eyes a bit and I really didn't like that. So hopefully next year's they make this a little bit bigger. Uh, that's it for the balaclavas, guys. Look forward to our next videos. Make sure you follow us on all the social uh, grams and faces and everything else and uh, leave me some questions if you have any, and I look forward to doing the next one with you. Clavas, definitely say it right. And we start again, what was that? What was that? <laughs> it's a